one eternity later. Hello, um, this is Matthew Lee from Tea Leaves Pictures. Um, first off, before you begin, uh, I'd like to say uh, thank you for uh, thank you to Blue Heart Tattoo for um, offering me the uh, or at least offering me the part of Discord or offering me let me take over the part from uh, Brian Random VA, who's a fantastic voice actor. I hope he's doing very well. Um, and I know it's, 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 for me, it's going to be very, very, very hard to fit into his shoes. I mean, I've, I've listened to his other work. He's, he's spectacular. So I'm going to try my best to kind of sound like him, but also try and do my own version of Discord in a way. I mean, similar to how the Wilson later said at the, at the uh, Bride of Discord panel a couple of years ago, I can't remember when that was, um, saying how he didn't, he d basically didn't try to sound like the character, he basically tried to embody the character, trying to, um, try to become the character rather than sound like him. So, uh, okay, throughout this recording, I'm going to try doing some of his lines the way Brian VA would have done it, but... Uh, but other times I'm gonna try do it a little differently. So um, that's just that's just a little heads up for uh, the series of recordings. But uh, right before we begin, <clears throat> I'm just gonna try and do a couple of breathing exercises. Just gonna try and do uh, try and get the voice of Discord right. <sighs> I mean it's not it's not like when I had to take over Brian B.A.'s character of whatever his name was in. Um, Demon's daughter, where I pretty much had to do a lot of ranting and growlings, because I mean he was a wolf and this is kind of a dragon, but uh, I'm gonna try my best. So, <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try and body my evilness. Where's my evilness? <laughs> oh yes, awful business. Oh yes, I. I do imagine so, but first I must ask you to never use it. Fluttershy! Nice to see you again. Anyway, I'm probably gonna need some water for this one, so. Uh, anyway, I, th I think I've stored long enough. Uh, on to the script. On to the script. What is it? Of course, I am a course. Well, excuse me for being honest in my t um. I'm gonna assume that's supposed to be in, not to my opinion. It's supposed to be in honest in my opinion. Being honest in my opinion. I think it's in. I'm gonna do both. Twilight, we went over the luggage four times last night, and you've rechecked them this morning. I doubt we missed anything. Bit missed. Bit my tongue. And then that man had the nerve. The nerve. If I only had the knife. <laughs> I realize now that it'd not be a very really good time for me. But and I completely forgot I was supposed to be the voice of Queen Regalas, uh, Chris Lewis's mother. But I've been sick for two days with a lot of things. Common cold, fevers, hot flashes and chills, all the good, you know, yummy stuff. So, since I have a congestion right now, my throat's all better, but I'm, you know, I'm running fever and it's not too great for me. So, since Never Ellis was, spoilers, basically dying in the scene, in the sort of like a voiceover flashback that Crystal is having, I might as well take my uh, sickness in, uh, in advantage here and record these lines. I just hope I don't sneeze in front of my yeah, in front of my microphone. Uh, and my stu- and I don't sni- sniff a lot. Uh. Oh. 
Let's go. In a hospital room. No one asked for your opinion. Stomach. My pet. Jay. Honey. Who you talking to? Come on. I know the quickest way to the library. Bye, 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 bye. To the lie, Barbie. You mean the mystical cr- eh? <laughs> You mean the black? You mean the black? <laughs> Sorry. <clears throat> Fluttershy? <laughs> uh, don't mind the stone dragon. Crystal dragon. Spyro! Wrong purple dragon. <laughs> uh, uh, Spyro, that one's for you. Great. Bit my tongue. Just as I'm starting. Ow! That wasn't intentional! It was an accident! <coughs> I guess... Brian, VA, how, how would you normally cope with this voice? And have the world at your hooves. Uh, I messed up there. Alright. <laughs> Let's count, count how many times I cough and gag and, and sneeze during this recording session. That will be number one. Well, I do believe in the chance of on. Uh. Applejack, I need permission from the mayor to send in these applications. But they told me she. <laughs> You might have something there, Brave. Oh, what was that? Ah! Oh. It's like it's like Disco's tried to turn to into a parrot. Ah! Oh. Brave. Eh, I wouldn't worry about her. Pinky gets easily excited with newcomers. <coughs> worry about me. <coughs> yes, this is perfect. We'll get our cutie marks for sure. I said I'm more like Scootaloo, sorry. What is your job supposed to be? A veterinarian? A zoologist? The next Tarzan pony? Wow, can you imagine that? Oh! Oh, oh, oh. oh no way, that's flesh. Ah! <laughs> Make a <our> race. <laughs> also, I kind of sound like the Emperor from Star Wars. Hey, feels your anger. <laughs> ah, damn it, number two. Hi, I'm Pinkie Pie. You know me as the bearer of the element of laughter, and I threw this welcoming party just welcoming, welcoming party. Not just a welcome party, no. Duh, I need another syllable there. We're ready to take off, Princess Twilight. I'm so sorry this took so long. Oh my god. Ah! Oh, there's a plane going by. <laughs> or a car. It's like a big car. <laughs> oh, come on! Just because I play one little trick doesn't mean you can have like a little grudge or something. I mean, come on! Oh, and what do you all have to say? What, you think just doing this little thing can finally give you your cutie marks? Well, well, guess what? You guys will never be at getting your cutie marks at this rate. Oh, oh, and you've got some nerve to talk to me, I miss you. I mean, you, Lil, you live, you live up with a couple of snobs in your cunt. You live with a couple of snobs in your cunt. You live with a couple of snobs who look down on every other pony just because they don't have a buck in their trunk. Where am I going with this? That doesn't seem right. Well, that's silly. What kind of welcoming party would... Now it's a welcome party, not a welcoming party. The first thing we're going to test is street performing. Street, street for, for, performing. Oh gosh, okay. Oh, a great, big, ginormous, super duper spectacular welcome party, not just for the princess of the bearer of the prince. This is somehow longer than the original. What is this? A 
Okay. Whew. I need water. <sighs> Just feel more takes, and you can have the humidifier back on. <laughs> the first thing we're going to test is street for street performance. Oh my gosh. The first thing we're gonna test is street for street performing. Street performing. The first thing we're gonna test is street for. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and if you don't have any friends, then you must be lonely, and that made me so sad. And then I had an idea, and that's why I went. Oh, I can throw a great big giant. Okay. I need a second. Oh my god. Woo! For me. I think I'm good enough here. <laughs> Wasn't as bad as I thought I was going to be. Well, guess I get the rest now. <laughs> Maybe picking up that mess on the floor would help me forget. I really should tell the girls to pick up after themselves more often. Bro! Bro! Just forget it! Man. They make you feel like a real jerk now. <laughs> then again, she was being a jerk, so, you know. You get what you're given, I guess. See? And now you two have lots and lots of friends! Huh. I did it. I got through it once. If I had children, I'd say tell them I love them. Whew. Time to do it again. Give you three takes of this bad boy. Though I prefer the fire swarms better. They make jogging a bit more exciting. <laughs> oh, I bet. Oh, I bet. Especially when you're, especially since it's like a fire swamp, you can you can literally play the game of all oh, that. You can literally play the game of the floor is lava. Literally. <laughs> Good game. That's not in the script. I just, I just, I just suddenly thought. I just read the line. I was like, I wouldn't be surprised if Discord came up with the game of the floors on fire at the fire swamps. Yeah, he's right. It does make jogging a bit more exciting. See, and now you two have lots and lots of friends. I'm not touching that line again, unless it's under extreme duress. <laughs> Eh, I try not to let it over. I try not to let it over. I try not to let it over. A little, 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 little. Turkey noises. Oh, don't worry. I just sent him to a dimension where he'll be quite well known. I see what you did there. Actually, actually, wouldn't it be kind of cool if there was like a pony version of Hercules, like the Disney version? No, oh wait, I shouldn't mention that because Disney might actually want to buy Hasbro at this point. No, no, you know, you know what? If there's a drawing of a pony version of Hercules and Felicitas and Hades in the background of this next scene, that would be amazing. <laughs> oh, ac oh, actually, actually, the. <laughs> Discord should be Hades. That would be amazing. That would be amazing. Please. Please. Someone. Anyone. Our commissioners. Do it. I want to see Discord as Hades. That will be amazing. Percy. What? Are you going to throw a fit at me? Right now? Just because you want to go outside? <laughs> yeah, you are. And you're lying on the door so it's not going to help your case. <sighs> sometimes I spoil my cat sometimes. Percy? No. No. I hope you can hear my cat all the way over there. No. <laughs> you can go outside in the morning, not now.
Percy. Hun. Sorry to do this, baby. Go. Better not tear my cup cozy up. No, baby. No. Come here. Oh. Just lay down on me so you can... Percy. My goodness, girl.